Okay, so what is a noxious fish? In Australia, a noxious fish is a fish that you are not allowed to keep and you are not allowed to import. If you want to figure out this, you need to go to the Australian Biosecurity um, website and then you'll find this page. And if you hit noxious fish list, then you will find a list of all of the noxious fish in Australia. So these are the fish that you are not allowed to have and you are not allowed to import. On the other hand, there's also the legal import list, which you can also find on this website, which means you are allowed to import and you are allowed to have. Now, the fish that are not listed on this website are the grey listed fish. The grey listed fish means they are not allowed to be imported, but you are allowed to have them. This includes many species that were here before these laws were um, top of, were, were put in place. Um, that's a lot of cichlids, that's lots of catfish, that's lots of fish that are very crucial to the Australian aquatic industry. The government has recently announced that they are going to get rid of the grey list. Now, if that is actually going to happen, it will have devastating results on the legal aquarium trade and it will absolutely boom the black market trade. It will also massively increase the chance of these fish getting dumped into natural waterways because if people have fish that they care about and love and they need to get rid of these fish and they can't just take it to a legal aquarium shop or do it in any legal fashion that will be okay for the fish, then there is a much higher chance of people going and letting these fish go. So, as far as I'm concerned, making the grey list illegal would be very irresponsible to the e ecosystem and it would be very irresponsible for the legal aquarium trade. It would be totally wonderful for the black market. The black market will love this decision. So we need to fight this decision. So please join the PIAA Pet Industry Association of Australia and have your voice heard. Contact your local members and tell them that getting rid of the grey list is completely irresponsible and it will be an ecological issue and it will also be a taxation issue and as far as anything legal is concerned there would be little benefit except trying to look like they're doing something. We need to protect our environment and we need to protect our industry. We need to keep the grey list.